around, Princess Mary is known for her impeccable wardrobe, which includes both designer and high street pieces. He also frequently wear outfit, demonstrating her environmental commitment as well as her concern for budget and financial issues. Mary, Grand Princess of Denmark, is the wife of Queen Margaret II's son, Frederick, Grand Prince of Denmark. Yesterday, January 3rd, Mary and Frederick attended a New Year's Eve reception at Copenhagen Christian Broke Castle, the Danish royal family palace. Speeches began the party, and Queen Margaret thanked the diplomatic crowd for their presence. Standing next to his wife, Mary, the Crown Prince also wished the guests a Happy New Year. Crown Princess Mary wore a stunning Julie Fagerholt gown for the occasion. The designer is Danish, and she has previously worn the gown. Interestingly, the royal wore the gown to the same event in 2017 and 2010, accessorying it accessorying it differently each time. The gown featured a gleaming silver bodice, long sleeve, and round neckline. It also had a tiny slit from the neckline to the skirt waistband. The skirt was silver as well, but it was covered in a leaf-like pattern. The skirt was figure-hugging, but the flower as it fell to the floor. Princess Mary's dress reached her feet, and her heels were barely visible beneath. Jan Vito 105 Fumo Grey Sweat Pump by Jan Vito Rossi were worn by Princess Mary. This is a popular brand among a Europe royal, with Queen Leticia, Princess Catherine of Wales, owning a pair of the designer shoes. Interestingly, Princess Mary has worn these shoes on numerous occasions since 2015. Princess Mary accessories her look with a Hugo Boss glass called the Soda, which is also grey and sweat. Her brunette hair was neatly slicked back in a low ponytail, and she wore her usual makeup of brow pencil and black mascara and shiny lip gloss. To commemorate Her Majesty the Queen 15th anniversary, the Danish family released a new portrait after Christmas. Princess Mary wore the iconic Danish ruby parrot tiara with grace. The Danish ruby parrot tiara was created for Tsar Clary Bernadetta, another Queen Desideria of Sweden to wear at Napoleon and Josephine coronation in Paris in 1804. When Princess Lovisa of Sweden married King Frederick VIII of Denmark in 1869, the jewel arrived in Denmark. The diadem has been passed on to a generation of Danish royals. And in recent years, Queen Alexandrine and Queen Ingrid as well as Crown Princess Mary have been seen wearing it. Princess Mary, who has worn the tiara on several occasions, is said to have altered it to make it more comfortable and fit her personal style. The ruby tiara is regarded as one of Europe's most glamorous and regular ruby diadem. It has diamond and cross silver sleeve, that surround a strip of rubies that reassembles red berries. The tiara was chosen by Princess Mary for Queen Margaret of Denmark Glamour's Ruby Jubilee celebration in 2012. The diadem was also worn by the royal in her 15th birthday portrait all real this year, when she looked stunning in a light blue gown. She wore a frog length gown with a long sleeve and a sinking waist by Danish designer Lasse Spanberg. The chose a very elegant long dress with a floral motif for the new portrait, and she looked stunning in the off-the-shoulder black glass gown. 
The portrait was taken in Christian Sixth Palace and Amalian Denmark in Knights Halls. 